So I'll open up the Q and A. Uh, please reach out to us. Uh, anything that you need, um, if you need anything, um, just reach out to us. Uh, we can help you uh, whether it's buying, selling, uh, or just need an ear to talk to about the real estate market. No problem. We're here for you. Uh, we're happy to help uh, and assist in any way. So uh, I'll open up to questions, comments, um, and uh, um, yeah, fire away. Okay, the first question we have is, um, what steps should I take to prepare my home for a sale? Uh, what steps would you take? So first and foremost is re reach out to us. Um, because we're providing you all of the solutions to, to sell your home, and what I mean by that is we're going to advise, well, one, is if, if I was your agent, what I would do is I would get on a Zoom call like this. You would actually uh, uh, get on your cell phone um, or some sort of other streaming device uh, that I can actually have you walk through it. If you have no streaming uh, device, I would actually – we'll send you a picture list that we need pic photos of the different parts of your home. And what we will do is we'll actually uh, uh, really customize it to what your needs are. So the first thing is we want to know what your current situation is, what you're looking to accomplish, and then we can advise from there. So one of the things to prepare your home to sell is reach out to us because we're going to tell you what the home is worth as is on the open market, what it would be if you did fix up a few things. And the reason I said, that I'm not answering it in the way of like, Hey, you should paint this. You should redo this. You should do that. The reason I'm not answering it that way is because your situation will dictate that. Um, we always look at it as like your ROI, your return on investment. And if it doesn't, if, if like painting that wall or redoing that kitchen and doing that bathroom is going to cost you more than what the ROI would be, we're not going to advise you to do it. So um, it, it really depends on your, on your situation. But uh, first step is, is that, yeah, we will uh, take a tour. Uh, there's no, uh, we don't charge for any consultation fees or anything like that. So just reach out to us and we, we can help you walk through that. Okay, the next question is, um, how do you determine how much my home worth? Uh, broke up a little bit there, but I think you said how much, uh, how do we determine how much your home is worth? Yes, absolutely. So, awesome. Yeah. Yeah, a great question. Um, so uh, a number of different ways. So we have what's called a market absorption report. So our market absorption report is we're going to pull the market stats of the whole entire county. Then we're going to break it down by the whole entire um, area and school district. And so what we do is we determine, all right, how much are homes selling on average in that area? Then we do what's called like an appraisal report. Uh, and they, in short, they also call it a CMA, a comparative market analysis. And with that report is we will look at other homes in the area, just like an appraiser does. And uh, we, uh, we will look at it, similar homes, similar styles, similar ages, similar square footages, uh, and, and definitely, uh, I think I said area already, um, but really homes in your neighborhood that have sold typically anywhere between three months and six months, but we will give you a report on, all, on the whole entire year um, because we want to see. And then from there, we do pros and cons um, of the different homes of, hey, uh, this one might have been a little bit better condition here. Um, and uh, so that's really the, the science behind it is we're going through it just like an appraiser looks at your home. Um, and uh, we've been trained by appraisers as well. So we're looking at the different ways that an appraiser would look at it. Um, and that's just a couple of the different ways that we uh, look at it.